have enough. And then she does that. And then there's too many to take care of. And she's in the way of a lot of them. And fuck. You're still doing your best to beat it. Yeah, and she corner trapped me again. Mm-hmm. A final boss shouldn't need a corner trap. That's just bullshit. Now I can barely get past her her first form. Now what if she's a three stage boss? She might be. But if it's a three stage, it'll probably give you a checkpoint before the third. <laughs> You're funny, Tom. Well, let's put it this way. There is a multi-stage boss in Super Goals. And you do get a checkpoint in midway, so if he's really inspired by that, there might be. Quarter stage trapping. That, you need to have more lives to do all this shit in. Or more health. Because it's not really that fair that... Well, you can go in with a shield the first time. Yeah, and it's still not fair. You need more than three hearts for this stupid bitch. Well, the shield makes it four. I don't have the shield anymore! Oh, well, yeah. I will never get it because it won't let me go back into that room that would allow me to change my weapon to something I can use. Yeah, that's pretty much the entire flaw of this design. True. This it's is that it now plants you with your base weapon, which your base weapon is the worst one for certain things. True. Especially this. I mean, I wish I had more of those tier crystal things to do stuff with, but... The last one. Oh well, yeah, because there's five slots, but no place to put them. Yeah. Can the tail just jump on you? Back to corner trapping. Nah, he's fine. I couldn't move, I couldn't do anything. It makes no sense to have it to where she's completely and totally inescapable. Well, I almost got her down now. You gotta get out of the way when she jumps the corner. He can't! I can't! It's either let her run into me, or run into her snakes. Well, don't stay there if she lets you get the fuck out. I just did that because I, I had X zero lives. Oh, it doesn't really matter how many lives you... Oh, right, that's a good point. Now watch, she does this, then she jumps, drops a snake, so... Two you... snake, yeah. Jumps, drops two, two snakes, snakes. Jump over. Yeah, and get hit by her fireballs. Fireball. Those two snakes get to the other side of them. Jump, go under her and the snakes. Never let her. Okay, now jump over that snake. The 
See what I mean? Yeah, she kind of overwhelms with snakes. Yeah, she doesn't need two projectile attacks. Well, I'm not trying to get this pattern down. Okay, so she summons snakes while she blocks. But it doesn't seem like she's as jumpy in this form, so you may be able to get through without trouble. Just focus on the snake on top! I know, I tried to jump back over and it wouldn't let me. Because I hit jump and it well, doesn't Once let you get to the jump. snake form, it seems like it'll be a little easier for you, though. Yeah, it's getting past this fucking. Why did he jump backwards? You can jump backwards. And it's the fact that she launches two of them at once and they don't leave the screen. I assure you what she's a bit air. I'd say if you get to the snake form with two hearts though, you might have a pretty good chance to get through. Okay. Credits? Yes! Okay, so that's not really... <laughs> you, you didn't get to the very last level, but you technically beat it with the worst ending. Uh, well... You technically beat it. I... I have you to thank for that. So you said, you could, you could fire up while she's jumping over to hit her while she's jumping over. I'm like, let's hit while the snakes are in midair, just take them out in midair. So that's what I started doing. But now my eyes hurt. Special thanks to you for playing until the end. <laughs> See you in the next adventure. Fuck you, no. <laughs> you guys really don't like this game, do you? No. No. <laughs> it has a headache-inducing soundtrack. Our, I'm sorry. All I can say is it the has... The witch has fallen, but, but the, the key, key is, is missing. missing. Poor Ramiro. The crusade has been in vain. I'm pretty sure he's about to turn into something. What? Yep. Damn it.
demons. The end? <laughs> to be continued? No. <laughs> no. We are so, not doing this game again. Sorry. All I can say about this is it had an alright soundtrack. Got repetitive after a while. Really good graphics. For what they were going for. It was just way too hard. And I know, I know. A lot of people say, well, you're just a bitch. Well, then you play it and try to get the good ending and try to get all the keys to get the, the ultimate tears. ending. And then after you do that, then oh, I YouTube. will personally come to you and punch you in the face because you're an asshole. <laughs> yes, exactly that. So, this game is worse than Ghouls and Goblins. In that it could have fixed problems that Ghouls and Goblins had, but chose instead to emphasize how bad they are. And yet, On top of that, making making one of the areas only passable by getting hurt. Not necessarily only by getting hurt, but you found a way to by getting hurt. So anyway, that's either way. You play through the whole thing, which means you probably like it at least a little, even that, if you don't want to admit it. No. That being said, Maldini Castilla, or Castilla, what the fuck ever. It's a damn castle. <laughs> so it's a damn castle. So that's it. I'm not playing it anymore. Don't ask me. If you ask me, I will take and shove a revolver down your throat and tell you to swallow it and hope it doesn't go off. So until then, I'm Scott. I'm Tom. I'm Wanda. And we're disappointed. Have a good day. Yep. Derpy's giving Mateo a bath. He pinned him.